Hello guys, and in today's YouTube video, I'm going to be going over this week in Trials. This week was the Immortal, or not the Immortal, the Astral Horizon, my fault, and uh, this is episode 54. Also, before we get into it, I'm thinking of doing an episodic series kind of like this, and it's basically just going, or no, it's 55, oh my god. Anyway, I think I'm doing a episodic series kind of like this, but it's just going to be basically like reaction content, and I'm just... I was thinking the idea is basically you guys send me footage like of a game, like a Bosco Cyrus game or a BOD or whatever, and I just react to it for the most part. And some of that reaction can be like, you know, insight uh, on, you know, the gameplay or just, you know, stuff like that. So let me know in the comments below if you guys think that's a good idea. It's something. Uh, I'm thinking about doing purely because the game itself doesn't give us a lot of content. So I think that might be an interesting thing to do. Anyway, to talk about the week, once again, it was Astral Horizon and it was on JAV 4. And this week, uh, you know, it's the end of the season, so it's going to happen. Uh, cheaters got first again, and this week was, I pretty much got, I got stream set by cheaters for like three days straight as well. And it's probably just because they have a personal vendetta against uh me in particular I, as i mean they're just really going after everyone though they're just playing and getting after it but this week was rough i i think these last i mean typically towards the end of the season it's always going to be rough though the player population is like at a really really low point and you know it's just always going to be the case and i just am so happy that it's over we got an iron banner week i'm gonna be doing some more variety content with the channel for probably this next season and this next week as well because i don't know we're gonna it's looking like we're gonna have a seven month season also uh i feel like the player population this week was pretty low compared to like other okay okay sorry my cat just <laughs> my cat just like walked over the go xlr my like mixer and i thought it fucked up the recording but we're good never mind <laughs> but yeah i'm, I'm kind of the, the trace rifle's good that's gonna be a really good pve weapon and i, I wouldn't say that is soul is a very good pvp weapon i mean it's a good snipe it's it is good uh it's just there's not really any good energy weapons that you can pair with it right now i mean unless you're going to use like drang or something like that and you're on controller but if you're a mouse and keyboard player like you can maybe use aikilos but why would you use aikilos when you have like you know a mortal and unending tempest so what my hope is that we get another uh energy target lock smg next season to kind of pair with a sniper like that like but i don't know we probably won't get that i hope we do because that would be like very hyped to farm for like a lot of people would want to farm for that whether that's uh i mean it, it'd have to be in like the seasonal weapons because eve like gms and stuff like that's just we already know what we're getting and what we're losing so and we're not going to be getting an smg to my knowledge i think for iron banner we're getting like an auto and something else i can't remember even what it is i think it's an auto and i'd have to go back and look it, the weapons were like so uninteresting like the weapon types i think it's precision frame auto so that's actually pretty good but my point is is it's it, it's just the weapons this next season like in terms of the vendors like vanguard and crucible and not crucible trials and stuff it, it, they just don't look interesting at all uh so hopefully the seasonal weapons are good at least from a pvp player's perspective they just don't look very good i mean i i like um i like precision frame autos like Amit, but they're not my first choice like if i'm gonna use a primary weapon i'd rather use a 120 or an smg and outside of that i'm probably not gonna use anything else because i don't know i just don't see a point unless you're like trying to have fun with another loadout but i am typically not doing that because like 99 percent of the time if i'm playing destiny i'm usually helping people so i hope you guys enjoyed this week i, I if, if you did play i mean that's one thing too is call of duty literally came out on friday like the day trials went live and i was saying it while i was streaming but it's wild to me that there are stacked teams like playing for free just like farming flawlesses and there's games like that out like if, if i was them i would be playing cod or fortnite or something else i i just i don't know what the allure is to playing destiny 2 when there's like all these like really good games out and destiny is kind of at a low point i don't know it's crazy to me like for me right now if i could i would probably just be playing call of duty all the time but that is because it just came out i'll get tired of it but I'm enjoying it. Anyway, like I said, hope you guys had a good weekend. Hopefully you got a good Astral, even though Astral is like nothing compared to Conditional. Although I will say Conditional or Astral, assuming Conditional gets nerfed, uh, Astral could be good because it does have one-two punch and it's an aggressive frame shoddy and that could be the new potential uh, bubble counter. You know, one-two punch shoddy, aggressive frame shoddy. That could potentially counter bubble. I'd have to do some testing. Um, and I, I'm pretty sure Cami Cakes at one point uh, advocated for it, but it's, it's a very niche 
like play style for the most part like to be able to swat and it's it's kind of hard to pull off as well because if you miss and don't proc the one two punch shoddy like you're probably not going to kill and he's dead conditional is nice too because if you freeze <laughs> if you freeze them they can't fight back they're just dead as well and you, you're not going to have that with a one two punch shoddy you're going to have to like oh you're going to have to hope that they are not able to like pull up their weapon and shoot you in time so anyway i'm going to end the video there hope you guys enjoyed uh this trials weekend um, I'm going to be playing Iron Banner tomorrow, or well, not tomorrow, maybe on Wednesday I'll be playing Iron Banner. Uh, anyway, uh, pretty much every day of the week that I'm streaming, which will probably not be Tuesday, but might be some other days. Well, that will definitely be some other days, uh, potentially Wednesday and, you know, other, other days in the week besides Tuesday. Uh, I'll be doing Iron Banner uh, and I plan to rotating out like people. And playing with viewers so if you guys are interested in playing with me or getting to play with me i will be doing that uh for probably a good portion of the stream and then be hopping over the cod so if, if any of that sounds interesting to you please make sure to hop over on by the twitch twitch.tv forward slash fizzle i'd appreciate that we'll end the video there you guys and i'll see you in the next one bye if you guys enjoyed the video please make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe as it helps out the channel a ton also subs are greatly appreciated because as of right now 57 percent of my viewers are not sub the channel in addition if you'd like to come say hi to me live i stream over on twitch pretty much every day and if you're looking to get into contact with me i've got a twitter and i'm very active with it i love you guys and i'll see you in the next one peace out